Hi, I'm Lucas Ballard. I'm a software engineer at Google, and I work on Google Safe Browsing. I'd like to provide more information for site owners who are notified that their site was infected with malware, specifically with the type error template. In case you're unaware, if your site was infected with malware, you can see a sample of infected URLs and the type of the infection when you verify ownership of your site in Google Webmaster Tools. Google Webmaster Tools can be found at google.com webmasters. In regard to error template, this type of malware occurs when the template used for error messages, such as 404 file not found errors, is configured to distribute malware. In this way, attackers can launch attacks on URLs that do not even exist on your site. To investigate, if you've verified ownership of your site in Webmaster Tools, copy a sample URL associated with error template. Please do not open an error template URL directly in your browser, as that can infect your current device. Instead, try using tools such as wget or curl to check for unwanted code returned when fetching the sample error URL. It's likely that you're able to confirm the malicious content on an error page. Next, log into your web server. Check server configuration files for an error page directive. For example, the error template for Apache web servers can be declared in the htaccess file. View this file, perhaps through an editor like BI, and scan for one or more error document directives. Error document will be followed by an HTTP status code, then the location of the error template modified to distribute malware. When you're ready to clean up your site, which is in the following step of our hack site recovery, you can either replace the HTTP access file with a known good backup, or you can delete the unwanted error document directives in the existing HTTP access file. Be sure to clean the actual error document files as well. Please be aware, however, that only fixing the HD access and error templates doesn't correct the underlying vulnerability that allowed the hacker to compromise your site in the first place. You're now up to speed on the malware type error template. Before you finish this step, be sure to review file system damage assessment for a more thorough investigation of your entire site. Thanks for watching.